Super Bowl of horse racing and for only the second time in its history is taking place this weekend right here at the Del Mar Racetrack. Yeah, the Breeders' Cup is a series of 14 races over two days with prize money topping $30 million. Yeah, but as News 8's Ariana Cohen explains, there's only one guaranteed winner, and that's our county because this event brings in big bucks. The Breeders' Cup World Championship, also known as the finale to horse race season, attracts people from all over the world. And Bubble Rock was off to a slow beginning. This is my first Breeders' Cup. I'm very excited. Long flight, but it was so worth it. Um, I came out with my racehorse, so I work for my racehorse, and we actually have three horses running today, so it's a really exciting event to be out here. Horse race enthusiasts traveled from across the globe to attend the 38th Breeders' Cup. Delaware. Charlotte, North Carolina. We're from Kentucky and Gina. California. <laughs> Visitors can't miss the fascinators, fancy hats, and fashion. The last time the Del Mar racetrack hosted one of racing's most prestigious events was in 2017. Del, Del Mar is on the rotation for the Breeders' Cup, so that's exciting. And then it just feels really good knowing that we're at the tail end of the pandemic and everyone is coming out. They're celebrating Del Mar. They're celebrating the Breeders' Cup. So when we hosted the Breeders' Cup for the first time in 2016, the economic impact was over $97 million for the region. So this is a big deal. The world really comes to San Diego. In 2017, we had almost 37,000 people. This year, organizers say they limited ticket sales to about 30,000 people due to the pandemic. The travel ban did cut, cut back on some European travel for this year's event. Now, that's fantastic for the economy here in San Diego. I mean, there's so many things that uh, have kind of faltered over the last year or so. And dollars coming into the county and the city is great for San Diego, great for Del Mar and all San Diegans. Because this is a special place, this is a special track with its history, and what a great scene here where the surf meets the turf. The surf meets the turf down at Old Del Mar, where many bidders are rooting for their favorite horse, including a hometown horse. But there's a hometown San Diego horse that we're all pulling for named Hot Rod Charlie. So let's hope that Hot Rod Charlie can pull out the win in the Breeders' Cup Classic and uh, do it for San Diego. We're spending a six behind them. Due to the positive economic impact, organizers say they hope to host another Breeders' Cup in San Diego soon. I'm Ariana Cohen for News 8.